lena ikala ngoba mhlambe sisemgodzini noma lena ikala ngoba mhlambe sekhona lo sayibamba timvu tati pegege uthi timlalele lo melusi tati pegege uthi timhloniphe lo melusi tati pegege wokuthi nangabe kuyenteka ngalendvuko yakhe weshaya shaya wakubheke kwekuthi tikuthathe loko constructively kunekuthi tiqaba ngekuthi sekhona lolwa nato uma ngabe setihlaselwa timvu tihlaselwa etigebeku noma tihlaselwa yini lokuhlaselako tathi bheke ukuthi tigijime tibhekela kunemelusi ngakhona leni na ngoba tathi kwathi kwekuthi tingefika kumelusi melusi utathi vikela kule danger lesetikuwe that to live together unity in the midst of diversity unity during trying times the team no man have been trusted by any that is strong and are so strong as cards and that is what God is expecting from us as God assures us that he shall protect us let us pray that God reminds us of who we are. Looking at the last year's unfortunate situations in the country, which is still continuing today, unfortunately, one realizes that we have forgotten who we are. Shepherds have lost the sense of what it means to shepherd the flock. Shepherds have lost a sense of servanthood. We have lost a sense of our true calling, that calling of being servants of the people. Shepherds have lost the sense of devotion, selflessness, humility, love, and care for the flock. God cannot be happy about what is happening in Eswatini. And God is not happy. And that's why is God, God is calling us together as a nation to sit down and look up to him as we start addressing our own problems. The flock has turned against the shepherd because of hunger. Ube se kukumgela na leti nye timfu ngo cheswa sitek chon ten. Una leti nye timfu kule sbaya. Otwa ti si tota le sbaya les. Utike patina nato I pray. Because one day they belong to this crawl. Respect is lost. Unity is gone. Humility is dead. Violence is has become the order of the day. And I pray to God that violence must stop. There is no true freedom if you want that, that you can get through violence. Violence will always be get violence. All this will never bring solutions. God is expecting us to work together for a lasting solution. I pray to God to help us as a nation to be able to forgive each other, to be able and, be and have the ability to listen together. I pray to God that we are able to talk to each other not at each other. Amen. I pray against the spirit of calling each other names because that will never make any situation better. Instead, it creates anger, hatred. I pray to God that God helps us as we rediscover ourselves as individuals and as a nation. Praise the we Lord. need each other in order to become our differing opinions must not be a source of division. It must not be a source of anger. It must not be a source of hatred. 
It must not be a source of malicious damage of God's given dignity of, of the other. So may God, our God, protect us as a nation and may God, our God, protect their majesties and God, our God, journey with us as we commit to a journey, a journey of rediscovery Amen. as a nation. Amen. Hallelujah. By it, we now part. Was it of us in Jesus? Hallelujah. By it, we now part. Was it of us? I guess it's a case. Silas Kulu and Tolo Lapa says it's a gory king Lisha. Says it's a bassanje. Libandan Alconac Sugoma Sali Sugome Senagas Bidis Kulum said to Sespil, when our Pagati, when they placed him Yam. Oh, Jesu. I under the shed, oh, Jesus, of his wings, we are saved. Oh, Jesu, Jesu.